is it possible to transfer data directly to the brain? All our feelings are formed in the brain. Regardless of the type of information received, whether it be the sounds of music, some smells or visual images, all of them are inherently just signals transmitted and decoded by specialized cells. At the same time, if you do not take into account these signals, the brain does not directly contact with the external environment. And if so, then it is likely that we have the opportunity to form new ways of interaction of the brain with the outside world and transmit data directly. Let's go back a couple of sentences back. If all information is just incoming impulses, then why is vision so different from smell or taste? Why do you never confuse the visual beauty of a pine with taste of feta cheese? Or rubbing sandpaper on your fingertips with the smell of fresh espresso? It can be assumed that this is somehow related to the structure of the brain, the areas involved in hearing are different from those that process data on visual images, and so on. But why, in this case, people who have lost, for example, vision, according to numerous studies, receive a reorientation of the visual zone to enhance other senses? Thus the hypothesis arose, the inner subjective experience is determined by the structure of the data themselves. In other words, the information itself, coming, say, from the retina, has a different structure than the data coming from the eardrum or receptors from the fingertips. As a result, and get different feelings. It turns out that, in theory, we can form new ways to transfer information. It will not be like sight, hearing, taste, touch, or smell. It will be something completely new. There are two ways to do this. The first is by implanting electrodes directly into the brain. The second is the receipt of signals by the brain non-invasively. For example, using wearable devices. Imagine wearing a bracelet with several vibration motors that stimulate different places around your wrist to form a data stream. When we establish a clear relationship between information and the type of touch, people can easily begin to recognize it. The Neosensory company is doing something similar at the moment, creating vibrating neural interfaces. One of these developers plan to submit in the next 2019.